everybody welcome to a one-handed cook and I'm really excited that um, it took me weeks and weeks to research and get bits and bobs and today I'm going to start my first adventure on sourdough bread making as I said in the beginning of the video my aim is to probably or hope to inspire others that has got a disability like myself or able-bodied people to overcome and achieve how am I going to achieve this well it's going to probably take three days the first day I'm going to take my active starter out of the fridge this evening I will feed the uh, starter in the morning I'm going to prep mixing the dough shaping etc etc leaving the bread or the dough in a proofing basket in a fridge until day three where I'm going to bake so stick around and watch my adventures this is the first time I've made it so bear with me we'll, we'll crack on thank you
on guys, probably the moment of truth about uh, reference the, uh, the flow test, flow test on the starter. It's floating. Ready to go. Oh yeah. This is 100 grams of the starter with the 310 grams of water to ready to mix. Wish me luck. This is a new territory for all I'm uh, using the food mixer with the bread hook and um, mixing in a bowl by hand you can do it. Push me up. Well, here you go. I hope mixed thoroughly, and that would be 30 minutes resting. Here you go. Well, guys, keep saying it. Moment of truth. This is going to be the first fold. I will slightly spray the work surface top of the door with water using the door scraper to ease the door out of the bowl under the wet surface. Starting at the start of the top door to have a look up position, pinch the ends between your fingers and thumbs and stretch upwards away from you and fold it over the the door towards the six o'clock position and press. Rotate the door slightly and repeat for 12 turns and work in and around the door to form a ball. Turn the door back over, smooth side up and return the ball. Spray top lightly with the water and cover the clean cloth and leave for rest for two hours. <laughs> Here we go.